Ryan with the Musician News, and we're at the Summer NAMM 2011 in Nashville. I'm at the Burley Guitars booth, and I'm here with uh, Jeff, Jeff Ayers. Ayers, and he's the owner, and he's going to tell us a little bit about his really interesting new, uh, they're hand-carved guitars and stuff, too. Tell us a little bit uh, about your stuff. Uh, Ron, these are all one-of-a-kind guitars. I, I start from scratch at my own sawmill, and I actually cut logs off my own property to, uh, to make these guitars. I've been an artist all my life, and carving is one of my specialties. What makes my guitars different is that I, they are all built around the center core, which features tuning forks that absorb and release the energy produced from the strings. And before this, uh, this was all lost. None of this energy was captured. And this is not really modern technology. They could have done this uh, hundreds of years ago. But I just happened to come across uh, the idea by accident and incorporate it into my guitars. Now, uh, I, I also. Happens as you play, then, I mean, this. This uh, is actually moving a bit. And yeah, yeah. It's the, giving you a the vibration caused by the string uh, uh, puts these tuning forks into motion, and uh, without being parasitical or, or changing the pitch in any way, it enhances the resonance and sustain of the guitar so that the note finishes off, uh, you know, much longer and, and with a deeper, richer bodied uh, 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 tone than than any other guitar has. Okay. So. Uh, it's a very simple concept. Yeah, it, is, it, just, it just works around uh, hanging on to the energy that the uh, that the strings created. Yeah. And uh, we, we're doing this one right here for the uh, Tennessee Breast Cancer Coalition. We have Ricky Skaggs' uh, signature on it. They're going to use this guitar in a fundraiser August 4th uh, for the uh, breast cancer victims or uh, survivors or in uh, the Nashville area. So oh, it's nice. a uh, we so you have some uh, acoustic guitars we, and electric. We, we do okay. acoustics and electric. These are all semi-hollow. I'm not much of a guitar player, I'm more of an engineer, Ron, yeah. so I'm just giving you this to, uh, to show people what they... What kind of wood is that? This is black walnut, and the, uh, the white wood is hard maple. It all comes from the upper peninsula of Michigan, where I live, and our really, we have really cold winters up there, so the wood gets extremely dense and it makes it uh, a better tone wood yeah it's a uh, book matched burled walnut but uh, we use a lot of bird's eye maple we use a lot of curly maple uh -huh. the um, uh, the one right behind you is cher is uh, burled cherry and uh, that's one of our prettier guitars here with the with the red colors but we do we do a lot of specialty things with the uh, the tail pieces if you notice this one has a breast cancer logo the one behind you has the, the dragon tail. Uh, we use TV Jones pickups. Oh, okay, cool. How do, uh, does someone buy one of these? Do they... www.burleyguitars.com. Oh, so you guys sell direct? We, we, we okay. will sell direct. Uh, we like to deal with, with the uh, guitar stores. We would rather be in the manufacturing and wholesaling end of uh -huh. it. So if, uh, if any shop wants to include these in their lines, we'd be more than happy to do spe a specialty line for them if they would like. We can do celebrity guitars. We can do guitars around any theme or any logo that, that people uh -huh. would have. Somebody so comes up with an idea that you can carve we're, it then. We're huh? very flexible, sure. We just, are you doing all these carvings or are you have yes. some other people too? No, these are all done all by you. hand. These are all done by me and it's all done with a mallet and a chisel. There's no CNC routers used in any portion of, of the guitar. Even the neck itself is just shaped by hand with, a, with disc grinders and very simple tools. Okay. So this is, this is really uh, a, a handmade guitar. Yeah, there, okay, there, there's is. no high speed equipment used on this at all. And How it, long it, would it take from start to finish on this, this you guitar? Know, I, I'm gonna say that I probably got about 50 or 60 hours in, into each yeah. individual guitar. Okay. It, it's hard to say, but uh, that wouldn't be my guess right now. Yeah. Well, yeah, some beautiful guitars. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Have a good show. Thanks very much.